Now let's bring you a report on the recommendations of the European Union, which they say could help improve Nigeria's electoral processes and uphold regional and international commitments. About three months after the general elections in Nigeria, the EU observation team has released the final report of the observations in the entire election. The final report contains six priority recommendations, which points to the need to remove ambiguities in the law, establish a publicly accountable selection process for INEC top officials, ensure real-time publication of and access to election results, provide greater protection for media practitioners, address discrimination against women in political life, and address impunity regarding electoral offences. INEC introduced some very positive measures early in the electoral process. For example, it increased the number of polling units and established a system of electronic accreditation of party agents, media and observers. Public confidence, however, in INEC was severely damaged on the 25th of February due to its operational failures and lack of transparency. While some corrective measures introduced before the 18th of March elections seem to have a positive impact, overall trust was not restored and eventually led civil society to call for an independent audit of the entire process. INEC promises to work with the recommendations and all the recommendations given by other observers. On administrative issues, as an electoral management body, we are going to harvest all those uh, um, uh, recommendations that border on administrative issues and we are going to implement them. There are also some recommendations that border on both constitutional and legal issues. We are also going to look at them and also see the ones that the National Assembly can deal with. But one thing that is certain, there is no country in the world that does not have institutions that resolves both constitutional and electoral matters, especially in democratic settings. The six priority recommendations, according to the EU observers, will contribute to improve the conduct of elections in Nigeria. The final report would also be presented to CSO's representative of political parties, INEC and other stakeholders before the end of the week. Moya Thomas, TVC News, Abuja.